Hey guys, what's up? Josh Mall with Swimming Pool Science, and today I want to talk about why I love variable speed motors so much over the old school single speed dumb pumps. I'm here over at the neighbor's house just checking things out on their pool, making sure things are good because they're not home, and they have got one of the Pentair slash Stayrite variable speed pumps. This one is more commonly known as the Pentair Intelliflow. This one just happens to be um, a uh, specific model um, built for a certain pool company that built their pool and it's in black and but it's essentially a Pentair Intelliflow and what I love about this pump is a couple different things now I don't know if you know this right now but this pump is actually running yeah it's that quiet it's about a quarter of the noise level of the air conditioning unit that's right over there and the air conditioning unit you know, I'm right next to this pump that air conditioning unit is about 25 feet away and that air conditioning unit is about five times louder than this variable speed pump is. Now, mind you, this variable speed pump is running in a low speed configuration right now, but what's great about that, I can change the speeds and I can tailor this pump to do exactly what I need to do for any specific pool. Now, I can do up to eight speeds on this pump. I have four available here that I can directly control with the buttons here, speeds one, two, three, and four, and then I have four other ones I can program through the back. But what's nice about this is whether you have a suction cleaner, you've got an in-floor cleaning system, or you do it the old-fashioned way where you vacuum once or twice a week, this pump can be tailored to fit those needs. So, you know, with the old pumps, all you had was, gee, let's see here, we're going to run it for 12 hours today instead of 10 hours. Well, this pump, I can say, you know, I'm going to run at low speed during the day for all day, and... I'll run at high speed at night for just a few minutes just so that cleaner can run. And you end up saving a lot of money that way. Now, the way it works is, if I'm trying to move a given amount of water through a pump or through a system, through a pool, I have so many gallons of water I want to turn over, um, in a certain amount of time, say I want to move 10,000 gallons in eight hours, it's going to cost me a certain amount of electricity to do, to do that. Now, if I say... I want to move that same 10,000 gallons in four hours, it's not going to cost me twice as much in electricity. No. The way the math works out, it's actually going to be eight times more expensive to move that same amount of water in half the time. Now, this is where the magic of the variable speed pump comes in because I can do this. I can say, you know what? We got 10,000 gallons here. We just need to get that 10,000 gallons moved in a day. So let's go ahead, instead of running and moving 10,000 gallons in eight hours, Let's move that 10,000 gallons in 16 hours. Guess what? We just moved the same amount of water and crunching the numbers and the way the math works out, we've just done that for a quarter of the price in electricity. So, um, you know, these pumps do amazing things. You can tailor them to your pool. You can dial them in to do exactly what you need them to do. And you can save a boatload in your electrical costs. Now, the other cool thing that I like specifically about the Pentair series of pumps is that they are overbuilt so much that you were just getting such a high quality piece of equipment now this pumps running at running about 1450 rpms which is less than half of what its maximum rpms is which is 3450 so what that means is right now we're only pulling 258 watts that's that's less than three light bulbs on it's pretty amazing stuff and i'll show you if we if you can see the screen right there we got our wattage, 1445. Now watch, let's just call that 1450 for the sake of doing it. Let's bump that up to 2900 RPMs and you can see how much the wattage changes to get an idea of. So I have the limit set at this one for a maximum of 2800, it'll go up to 4950. But so you can see we just doubled our RPM, but look how many more watts we're pulling. We're pulling seven times the wattage now. So that gives you an idea of the, the difference, the electricity that it takes to the more water you want to move, it takes even more electricity that jumps up even higher. So it's, uh, it's a pretty cool thing, these variable speed pumps. Now, I want to get back to talking about the quality and the workmanship in this thing. Uh, these pumps, of course, all pumps are water cooled. They're water cooled by the water that moves through the pump, through the wet end here. And a lot of your old style pumps, they do have an internal fan built inside, but it's passive air. And the problem with that internal fan is you've got to have open air ducts to the internals of the motor. So that means the internal, the internal components of that motor are 
exposed to the elements, any moisture, any raindrops that come down, reflect up and bounce in, there's gonna get moisture in there. If you got sprinklers nearby, all that's gonna cause damage. If you have a leaky seal, you're gonna get damage on the inside of that motor or a winding can short out or something like that. With these, they're totally sealed. They're water cooled here and there's a fan built in right here and you can actually, let me see, I'll get those RPMs back up and you can see how much air that fan moves when I crank that up. So they take and you can see you can see how much air that moves. That fan just moves a ton of air to keep that motor cool and so you know, we got a lot of cooling there without compromising the internal components of the motor that are so critical. The other cool thing about these motors is that they're already detuned from the factory. This, this, this particular motor at 3450 RPMs is capable of just over three horsepower. Well, they detune it. Um, they detune it from six horsepower. So, so this motor is capable. If you were an electronics guy, you could hot rod this thing. You could actually get six horsepower out of this motor right here but it's detuned from the factory down to three horse and then on top of that we're we're tuning it down even further by customizing that rpm and that duration of time so this motor unlike a standard single speed old style pump is running at maybe 20 15 percent 40 percent of its maximum potential whereas your old style pumps are running at 80 to 90 percent of their maximum potential so with these and i can tell you this from installing these for five or six years I don't come back and do repairs on these. I don't, I just operate them and I run them. And it just, it's just the homeowners like them. I like them from a service standpoint and it's certainly a great investment. Now you're gonna pay significantly more for a motor like this or for a pump like this than you would for a standard old style pump. But remember, this thing is 90% more energy efficient than your old style pump. Then on top of that, you add the increased, the, uh, the decrease of maintenance and the increased reliability and you're going to save in the long run a mountain of money. I mean, these motors, they essentially pay for themselves within two, three, four years. And then that's money in your pocket every year that you'd otherwise be giving away to the electrical companies. So, so if you're in the market for one of these variable speed pumps and you're on the fence, I recommend picking a good one for the Arizona, Nevada, Southern California, Texas, New Mexico market. Man, for me, my money is on the Pentair products, particularly the IntelliFlow, IntelliFlow XFs, the VSFs. They're all fantastic pumps. They're all highly programmable. You can do a lot of great stuff and the proof is in the pudding. I see them lasting a long time. I don't repair these because they don't break. So it's a, a, a pretty cool, excellent thing. And you know, if you're in the Phoenix area and you need someone to install it, give us a call at 602-456-5545. I'd love to come out and take a look and send one of my, my awesome service guys out to get you into a, into a new variable speed pump and get it tailored to fit your pool. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.